Okay, it's okay. I, I find the problem with you is you, you tend to not be very sure about yourself. I don't think there's anything to fear if you enjoy singing. Next in line was Cheryl Lim, who had more than just the judges to convince the first time around. If Cheryl were, were to be given a chance, she may have to, you know, consider the fact that she may have to stay away from school. So how do you feel about it? Maybe she got to extend for one year for the school. Okay, well that's good. I'm gonna keep my head held high Cause there's always gonna be another mountain You're always gonna wanna make it move There's always gonna be an uphill battle Sometimes you're gonna have to lose I just want to ask, your parents still standing by your decision? Yes. Okay. While Cheryl can only hope for the best, her chance of swaying the judge's decision in her favor is rivaled by our next contestant, Charlene Tan. We met her in the first editions where she shared with us her motivation behind singing. That's why I guess I want to do this and, and, and sing and, and share my talent with the world because I know it's something my mom gave me and yeah. Standing close to someone else now I sit all alone, wishing all my fear that was gone. Is there something else that yeah, you know? Another song? <clears throat> uh, I can try Valerie. Okay. And I think of all the things, what you're doing in my head. I paint a picture. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Since I've come on home, well, my body's been a mess. Your personality I... shows better in the second song. But just when the producers thought Samantha was the only one who was late, Ruben Raj shows up. Okay, one, two, three, four. Why were you late? I got the, the timing mixed up. Did you go to the workshop? No. Oh, why didn't you go to the workshop? Um, I had something really important to do. I think there's a commitment here, right? When you take part in a competition, you're supposed to give your all. The thing is, I had to finish whatever I could so that um, I can make up for what I'm going to miss for the next week. But then you miss the workshop. You feel that that's not important? Mm, well, I had to make, you know, I had to... F Let even... me put it this way. Did you even bother to call the producers of the show to tell them that you're not going to attend? No. Okay, I think you should leave now because I don't think you qualify and I don't think you have the right attitude. This really means a lot to me, yeah? Because if it meant a lot to you, you would have turned up on time today for a start. I, I thought it was, it was, it was actually 2 o'clock. I thought it was 2 o'clock. It's very so, unfortunate, okay. but it's a double whammy. You didn't yeah. turn up for the workshop, nobody knew why, and then you were late. Please? I mean, I know I can do this. No, no, look. It doesn't work that way. Just accept it and go. With his idol journey cut short, Ruben's dream of becoming the next Singapore idol remains nothing more than just dreams. As the judges begin to deliberate on the fate of our top 100, contestants outside could finally take a well-deserved breather. But before any final decisions were made, the judges sprung a call back for some of the contestants. Hey, hi, guys. Hi. hi. What's happening? What's going on? I have no idea. I'm just no idea. Yeah. Do you guys um, like know what you did wrong? Um, I allowed myself to be very nervous. I think the, the point that is most important right now is um, the judges are really, really trying to help you guys yeah. this time around. So there is no excuse right now to to uh, to mess up, get a lyrics or anything like that. So why do you deserve a spot in the next round, brother? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> why you forgot your lyrics? Um, actually, the song I chose a week back, and uh, why why doesn't anybody say I just screwed up? 
Yeah. I, I did screw up. I'm not going to bother with excuses. Uh, I'm really thankful for this second chance. Um, I think How I do you w- know it's a second chance? It could uh, be your last. <laughs> oh, well, at least it's a chance. Um, I'll, t- I'll take any chance that I get. Um, yeah. Um, as for this tablecloth, um, I'll change a new one or something. Um, a new tablecloth? <laughs> another dress, sorry. <laughs> not another tablecloth. You want to listen to her sing? Mm. Mm. Yeah. Can you just belt out your song now? Where troubles melt like lemon drops Away above the chimney top That's where you'll find me Come 2377, come. I actually wanted to uh, be able to be given uh, an opportunity to sing another song. Why? Because uh, the reason why I chose um, that song, Smile by Michael Jackson, is because uh, I grew up listening to his music um, for real. Like I, I'm, I'm a huge, avid fan of Michael Jackson. Now. Listen, yeah. you are here to be in the competition. No one cares what you think or how you feel about Michael Jackson. Okay, you screwed up. That's what you should have said. Um, have you got something else that you could actually sing to us? Uh, yes, I've got um, uh, "Like a Star" by Corinne Bailey Ray. Okay. I don't argue like this with anyone but you. We do it all the time. Tell us why do you think you deserve to go into the second round? Um, it makes me feel happy when I can perform, and hopefully to go in the second round, you know, I can do better because that is my whole purpose of joining this competition is to better myself, to learn more things. If okay, don't talk rubbish. No. I don't understand what you're the saying. The question is this. Um, you didn't sound very good just now. Mm. Uh, we want to know if you can do better. Yes. Okay, can you just uh, maybe sing something? I'll do the same song again, but then I'm going to start off the lower key. You gotta feel that heat, and we're gonna ride the boogie. Share that heat of love. Let's say there's only one spot. It's either you or your brother. What will your decision be? It's a tough one. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's there for me emotionally. Like, if I'm down, I'm definitely sure he'll be there for me. You know, that's always a question, you know. Will he be there for you? Or will he be selfish and go ahead on his own? No, definitely not. He'll be there for me. I'll take it. Um, I want it as well. So you both kill each other for it. Slaughter your brother aside. <laughs> I think he's a trick question. And on that note, the contestants were sent to the Orchid Country Club, where their fate will be revealed. I dreamed I was missing, you were so scared, but no one would listen, cause no one else cared. It's, it's the end of a very, very long day. We're here to give you the results. Who stays and who goes? Find out next on Singapore Idol. It's been a trying day one, but the time has come for the moment of truth. It's the end of a very, very long day. We're here to give you the results. I thought I was facing a room where there could be, you know, a top ten, but I really don't even feel that anymore. So I, I will just say overall that I'm very disappointed. A bit fed up. So you've got to work really, really hard and come back with more congratulations.